Hey, it's me, Zanov, and welcome back to Fallout for the Very Hard Playthrough. How are we doing, guys? I'm doing fantastic myself. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough as much as I am, please consider liking. Please consider subscribing. It all really, really helps out. Now, in this episode, we are... Who's that? Do I have a follower with me? I can't even remember. It's been like two weeks since I've recorded for... Since I've recorded for Fallout 4, so forgive any... Uh, for, what? Let me out of here. Uh, okay, buddy, okay. Oh, can I not get... Oh, jeez, I'm blind. Uh, okay, so that's closed. I think that's a follower I got with me. I can't believe. I can't. I'm not believe. Stop talking to me. Stop talking to me. Stop talking to me, please. I can't. I can't. Yep. Yes, yes, yes. I can't remember who I've got with me. Is it Nick? Oh, I can see through here. Is it Nick? Yeah, it's still Nick. Okay, okay. All right. Um, so, we, last time, from memory, we... Oh, she stopped talking to me. We uh, un we set manual override on all of these and we killed Lorenzo. However... I reloaded that. I wanted to see what would happen, but I reloaded that, and I think the actual course of action is I want to free think Lorenzo everything and uh, see what he does. Who do you think is really the crazy one here? Okay, guys, please stop talking to me. But yeah, let's uh, let's go this way. Boom. Unlock cell door. Talk to Lorenzo oh, Cabot. Long last, you did the right thing. You'll see. Okay, cool. Don't do this. Too late, Jack. Why don't you wait there so that we can have that little chat that's so long overdue? Get away while you can! It seems Jack doesn't want to talk to his father. We'll have to kill him, you know. Oh, jeez. And all the rest of them. <laughs> okay, maybe I didn't pick... Maybe this isn't... Maybe this isn't the uh, right course of action. <laughs> jeez. All right, uh, Lorenzo. Okay. Uh, well, I said we'd continue. I said we'd do it this way, so I guess we'll do it this way. But you're seeming pretty bad here, bud. Killing all. Well, I guess they did have you locked up. Mm. Yeah. I, um, okay. I'm having a little bit of trouble remembering everything right now because it has been a couple weeks. But um, I don't know. Maybe the maybe I'm misremembering what it is they've done to you. I mean, they have had you locked up. Okay. Let's actually let's actually chat to you and see what your side of everything is. How long have you been locked up in here? How long have you been locked up in here? My loving son trapped me here in the year of our Lord, 1898. So My gosh. Almost 400 years. Yeah, I, I don't blame you. I think you were about you. to agree to helping me <laughs> kill Jack and the rest of my traitorous kid, yes? You're seeming way too... <laughs> You're seeming uh, very keen on this. Uh... Say I do help you kill Jack and the rest of your family. What's in it for me? Sounds good to me. I never agreed to kill any... Oh, my gosh. Okay. Um, well, yeah. Say I do help you kill them. Well, like, not what's in it for me necessarily, but what happens? Say I do help you kill Jack and the rest of your family. What's in it for me? What Jack stole from me, I will give to you freely. The gift of immortality. But Is that your little I serum thing? business to deal with. With your help, I trust. Meet right. me at Cabot House. I'm sure that's where the rats will congregate. Can I talk to you any further? Excuse me. We'll talk after my family is dealt with. All right, you're pretty, <laughs> you're pretty set on just killing it. So that's that's your son Jack. That is your daughter and your wife. You're just gonna. Did you just open the door? You're just gonna kill all. I, okay. Well, I mean, I said I said this is the way I wanted to do it, so I guess we'll roll with this. <laughs> I was not expecting him to just be no. So what, what's the word I'm looking for? So nonchalant about. Oh yes. Well, now we just have to kill the rest of my family. <laughs> okay. <laughs> all right. Massachusetts Surgical nice. Journal. I think I picked this up last time. Permanently inflict plus two percent limb damage. Okay. Cool. Cool. So cool. Was lost when the bombs hit. Yes, indeed. Good to see someone trying to. Yeah, not really, doesn't really uh, pertain or connect too heavily to our actual uh, situation here. But yeah, I'm sh uh, I, yeah, you're, you're correct. You're correct. At least somebody's trying to bring it back or whatever it is you said. All right, let's, uh, let's just take what we can. Oh, chessboard. What is my carry weight looking like? Oh, I've got three level ups as well. Uh, inventory. Carry weight's not looking great, so I want to be careful maybe a bit selective okay i reckon that's i reckon that's all we'll grab that's all we'll grab from here Alrighty, nick let's uh let's get rocking and rolling make sure i haven't missed any like floor safes or anything i'll be with you in a tick wall i should really grab these i really actually should they're uh they got some mystic oh 
the three of them here. Okay, yes. boom. Mysterious Serum. So damage resist 50 for 60 minutes, rads minus 10 per second for 60 minutes, and strength plus 5 for 60. This is an insane serum. This is actually an insane serum, how long its effects are. Excellent. Wow. And to be getting a bunch of these, this is literally like god god mode kind of serums. Like you inject yourself with this and you and I haven't even done it yet to lefty. Did I kill people in here? Am I really am I really having that much trouble remembering killing people in here? I must have. I must have killed people in here. Yeah, there's but okay. I don't know how I'm having trouble remembering that. Nick hey, though, I need something? to trade with you. Hopefully I haven't I have. I've left you nice and full. Okay. Well that's not good. <laughs> that is not good. Um what can I give you? You can't really carry anything else, can you? 217. Okay, what can I drop? Am I carrying any useless weapons? Okay, VATS enhanced. Improved VATS hit chance. Okay, I can probably drop that. How much is... How much weight is that? 3.5? I can definitely drop that. It's a legendary thing, but, like, I, I don't even use VATS, so... Alright. Uh, no, not take all. I'm still in his inventory. I was just about to take everything off of him. That would have been heartbreaking. Uh, but it does look kind of cool. It does look kind of cool. No, all good, all good, all good. Don't need it, don't need it. Hunting rifle hardened and recon. Have I been using this all that often? 308, 308, sniper rifle, damage per second, damage per second. Range is better, or far better on this one. Accuracy is a bit better on this one. Weight is... Weight is a little bit heavier. Value is a lot less. Uh, this has got some attachments on it though. Mm. Anything I can just get rid of. Laser rifle, agitated and focused. I can probably drop this, right? Because that's not my... Uh, I can probably drop this. Okay, let's drop that. Hopefully I didn't want that for anything because I genuinely cannot remember. If I did, oh well, to loot. No need to keep thinking about it now. What's done is done. We're up. We're out of here. Okay. <laughs> I really, really apologize if I said anything in the previous episodes regarding to those specific things that I just dropped. Uh, but yeah, I cannot remember. So this is this is basically a new zone of plan right here. System status. Let's have a look-see here. Main elevator, normal. A bremelum field. Offline, offline, offline. I kind of remember if I um if I went through this terminal. Uh, door one, door two, door five. High security cell access. Uh, systems normal. Yeah, dit, dit. Systems normal and unauthorized as access detected. All right, a Bremlin field offline, offline, offline. Okay, all right, okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, oh jeez, uh, these microscopes are good. Look at the, what they come with. So gear, glass, crystal, fiber optics, and screw. Those are pretty good materials to have. Um, how much do they weigh per thing though? And what can I drop if I want to pick up another one? Really. Uh, silver Shroud Armor. I really need to drop this off because I don't feel like I'm ever going to be putting it on. Silver Shroud Hat. I don't want to just... I don't want to just... I want to store them somewhere, though. Ugh. I really need a place where I can... Oh, I do have a place. It's just one of those workshops. How much does that weigh? How much do those things weigh? Okay, so I need I need to find space for two. Space for two. I can do this. I can do this. Give me, give me something that I don't really need a lot of. Something that's crazy heavy and not really all that useful. Um, okay, I haven't really picked up anything that's considered useless, I would say. Um, uh, okay, I can probably get plenty of steel. I don't think steel is ever going to be a huge problem. So I'll drop three of those and then I'll drop an ashtray as well. Okay, we're set. We're set. The fiber optics thing is definitely, definitely uh, a better thing to be carrying around. I would, I would surmise, just for the amount of unique materials it gives you. Okay, well, Nick, are you still stuck in that room? If you are, toodaloo. I am leaving, not waiting for you any longer. See you later. And light, because help. I keep on. Nobody needs help there, Nick. We're just going up in an elevator. I'm gonna, I need to really, really remember to turn on my light. I keep forgetting. For me, it's like dark, but it's still seeable, so it doesn't like prompt me. But I know for you guys, it's definitely a lot darker. Just recording through... Oh, jeepers. Okay. Just recording through OBS and then it being... I don't, I don't know the exact technical process, but however YouTube compresses it or whatever the uh, correct terminology is, it just makes it darker. That much I do know. And uh, I keep on forgetting to to uh turn my light on so everybody can see just as clearly as i do now i'm not going yeah i'm 
definitely going the long way back. I was just seeing if this was something I haven't explored yet. If there was like some little back room with like, a, you know, a nice little boss chest that Bethesda's hidden from me, but it doesn't seem to be the case. Seems like we can just head straight out through this way. Yeah, into the Commonwealth. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, uh, looks like we're meeting Lorenzo back at the Cabot house, and it looks like he's got a uh, bone to pick with his entire family, seemingly. I thought maybe it would just be Jack Cabot, and then he would just uh, leave his leave his family alone just to be like, oh, I know you guys are, like in on it, but not directly in on it or whatever. But um, nah, Lorenzo don't don't take none of that. Lorenzo, Lorenzo don't give don't give a single don't give a single beep, as you would say. <laughs> he don't he do not care. As far as he's concerned, they're all complicit, and they're all complicit, and they're all gonna die for it. <laughs> oh, the man, the man is. Uh, well, I suppose you can't blame him. Locked up for 400 years will probably do some strange things to you. Locked up for 400 years, uh, under the premise that you're crazy or whatever, or at least everyone else is being told that you're crazy or you're unwell, but you're perfectly fine walking around, and 400 years in a little room. Yeah, come to think of it, that's got to do some stuff to you. That has got to do some stuff to you, and I don't, th I don't think any of it's healthy. Uh, now, what are our other quest markers? Meet Travis at the Beantown Brewery. What's that? That's got to do with the, the little pub thing in uh, Diamond City, doesn't it? I believe it's that. i got to go get somebody back. I can't remember who it is, though. But we will get around to that. Let's go to the Cabot House first, because i got to say, I really want to see the end of this. This is seeming uh, pretty crazy <laughs> to me. Pretty crazy indeed. Pretty hectic all around. Um, I don't know. I'm interested to see if they have, if they do chat at all back at the house, or it's just okay. Open the door and let's slaughter these people. I really hope there's some kind of conversation or interaction, like one final. I don't know. Jack, Jack trying to explain himself one final time, or something like that, or Lorenzo extending an olive branch. I, I really no. Nah, after what he was saying back at the. Uh, Back at his little room there, I don't think he's really interested in extending an olive branch for anything. Oh, hey, Jack. What's going on? Fancy seeing you here. <coughs> ah, hello. <laughs> hello. <laughs> and that door's not rendered in properly. Uh, there we go. I'll Are you going to... Uh, we haven't... Uh, uh, we, we're, we're kind of in the middle of something. Uh, how about some doo-wop hits instead? Maybe... Okay, um... What was it? No, 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 no. Wrong time, Nick. We're, we're, we're quite literally in the middle of something pretty big here. So Jack Cabot's just run back. Um, interesting like, interesting to see that this thing hasn't been uh, programmed to kill me on sight right now. I would have thought that might have been something Jack would have done. Well, I suppose he only just got back as well. All right, let's see if there's any kind of interaction. I'm done talking about it. I'm done speculating. Let's actually see. I'm pretty keen. I'm pretty keen. All right. Have you lost your mind? Why did you release Lorenzo? Oh, 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 uh, I'm sorry I let him go. That was a mistake. You were just keeping him prisoner to keep yourselves alive. I wasn't sure who was telling the truth, you or him. Uh, is Lorenzo here yet? Is Lorenzo here yet? No, of course not, or we'd all be dead already. Now answer the question. Why did you free him? Yeah, I gotta say, um, you probably would be all dead already. He seems pretty hell-bent on killing you guys. He literally asked me to slaughter you <laughs> with him. Um, I'm sorry I let him go. That was a mistake. You were just keeping him prisoner to keep yourselves alive. I wasn't sure who was telling the truth. I feel like this is the thing, to be honest. I mean, he was perfectly fine, and you left him in a room for 400 years. Uh, you were just keeping him prisoner to let's keep go with yourselves that. alive. That's a lie. I've worked for centuries to find a way to cure him. But he doesn't want to be cured. He likes what he's become. Hold on there, Jack. He has a point. Your story about curing Lorenzo... Has never quite added up. Ooh. What are you doing, Edward? Edward's just back like in me. Hear what he has to say. He's talked to Lorenzo. I never have. You're saying you think Jack's been lying about Lorenzo all this time? Yeah, I would say so. You've been working for Jack a lot longer than I have. What do you think? Yes, Lorenzo doesn't seem crazy to me, although he's understandably pretty pissed off. No, Lorenzo Lorenzo really is a homicidal maniac, but I doubt Jack was trying very hard to cure him. I don't know. He seems pretty crazy now, but who wouldn't be yeah, after being locked up for 400 years? Yeah, I know this isn't a huge issue right now. Um, Let's go with this. I feel like this will extend it out a little bit more, see what Edward has to say, and then we'll say one of these. Edward. You've been working for Jack for longer than I have. What do you think? You've been working for Jack for a lot longer than I have. What do you think? I already know what I think. 
I want to hear what you think. Fair enough, fair enough. Um, I think I can kind of... Can I pause it here? Good, good, good. Okay, I can pause it. All right, I need to go to... Stay there, then audio. Uh, voice. Voice is all the way up. Okay, I think someone was saying that they couldn't hear people's voices or something. Um... So maybe I'll go music down a couple, master up a couple, and see how that goes. Because I feel like someone was saying that they couldn't... I, I think I'm pretty sure I read a comment saying you guys, or at least that person, uh, couldn't hear the voices and they thought I had them turned down. But they're all the way up, so I'm not sure what else I can do. But we'll see if this changes anything. Let me know if it's still a issue for you guys in the comments, please. Uh... Okay, so he already knows what he thinks. He wants to know what I think. Yes, Lorenzo doesn't seem crazy to me, although he's understandably pretty pissed off. Uh, I mean, yeah, I'd say so. As again, maybe a little bit, maybe a little bit of a maniac kind of thing. TikTok. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Maybe a little bit of a maniac, but like 400 years. I mean, I know I'd be pissed off. <laughs> I'd be pretty mad. Yes, Let's go with this. Lorenzo doesn't seem crazy to me, although he's understandably pretty pissed off. Well, goddamn. I guess you have some explaining to do, Jack. You can't seriously mm. doubt me, Edward. After all I've done for you? It sounds like he's doubting you. Oh, um. Ah, you're here. Ooh. Good. Oh, this is this is pretty this is pretty scenic. Cause he's just like that powerful, he's just teleported into the house. Let's go. Uh, how did you get in here? Why so surprised? This place is this more is of a oh, sure, Schnick. I like what you've done with the place. Lorenzo. God, you finally escaped. Jack just wouldn't listen. That seems... You have all betrayed. Yeah, that didn't sound very convincing there. It sounds like you're kind of a part of it. me like vampires to prolong your pathetic, worthless lives. That is now over. Your time is up. Ooh, okay. Ooh, kill the cabots, okay. Let me get out, let me get out. Oh, jeez. They're, they're just going... I don't even need to do anything. Ooh. Slaughtered. What did they okay, guys. Sorry for the abrupt cut you've probably witnessed there. So what happened was I ran out of disk space while I was quite literally in the middle of recording. So it just stopped. I heard a big notification sound and was like, what was that? And uh, looked at OBS and it said, I have insufficient space to keep recording and then i checked my hard drive and there was about 19 megabytes left <laughs> of space or my ssd and there was about 19 megabytes left of space so yeah that i wasn't squeezing any more time out of that so i had to quickly delete a whole bunch of videos i have to continuously do that to balance it out i just haven't done it in a long time um but yeah sorry if there was an abrupt cut uh i'm not exactly well i think i think i know exactly where it uh cut off but i'm just gonna load back to here just so we can experience that whole sequence again hopefully not badly interrupted and boom let's continue on um okay how, how did you get in here why so surprised this is my house this place is more a museum nick you you are just awful i i hate that so much <laughs> i cannot even god you finally escaped jack just wouldn't listen uh-huh uh-huh very convincing you have all betrayed me kept me a prisoner and fed off me like vampires to prolong your pathetic Worthless lives. That is now over. Your time is up. Okay, and I, I do not even need to do... Oh, Dreepers! <laughs> I don't need to do anything. Edward just goes straight in, doesn't even... Does not even question it. Nick's an absolute beast. <laughs> just murders two women. <laughs> and then tells me if I lost my mind. Uh-huh. Yeah, alright, buddy. Alright. <laughs> so, oh, okay, we've got... Oh, that looks pretty interesting. We've got a Zeta gun. Wowza. So Zeta wave barrel. Oh, I'm really keen to use this. So it does 10 da gamma damage. That doesn't seem like a ton, <laughs> but maybe I can upgrade it or something. This definitely looks very interesting. What is the trick? Okay, there's the trigger, that thing there. Gosh, this looks like it's quite uncomfortable to wield, but looks like it's definitely got some interesting properties to it keen to have taken that bottle cap gamma round fusion cell laser pistol cabots lab coat lab coat what do these entail uh so intelligence wait that, okay nothing big glasses yep nothing except perception and laser pistol just a standard laser pistol okay we won't take that and i'm over encumbered terrific love that okay well lorenzo well, how are you doing my done. friend 
Thank you for your assistance. <laughs> Quite welcome. I mean, it seems a little cold-blooded, but uh, I suppose it's maybe not cold-blooded after 400 years for you. Just kind of seems that way for me, how quickly everything kind of just turned around like that. You know, I was chatting to these people, being friendly with these people, and now they're dead. And uh, it seems like Nick's getting comfortable. Edward's probably going to take a seat as well. And there's just dead bodies about the place. It's just a little bit of an abrupt switch to me. I hope you understand, Lorenzo. <laughs> so what are you going to do now? They had it coming. You really are insane, aren't you? I didn't do this for nothing. Uh, what are you going to do now? What are you going to do now? Well, it seems that things have changed while I've been away. I have so much to learn. This yeah. new world seems to be one of limitless possibilities for people of our talents and inclinations. Well, yeah, at least I know for my guy now, he's pretty much found um, immortality. Immortality in a needle. So it's definitely limitless for, for me and yourself. Yeah. Uh, what are you talking about? The world's been destroyed. I can see that we're going to get along just fine. Don't compare yourself to me. We're nothing alike. If you like dirt, radiation, and random violence, you're in for a treat. <laughs> that's, that's a Bethesda game in a nutshell, except for Skyrim, exchange that for wilderness animals dragons and just uh, and just about every other creature including people wanting to kill you in your travels uh what are you talking about the world's been destroyed you're looking at things the wrong way oh, why the does it skip like that were paid for by an infinity of rules and restrictions there was there. no room for a truly creative mind to flourish now okay there's nothing to stand in my way or yours but first one Fair last enough. <laughs> piece of unfinished business. I promise to share my blood with you. And I always keep my promises. All right, okay. Okay, so we've got another one of these things. Cool. Here All right, cool. Here is your reward. I will provide you with a lifetime supply as needed. Well, this but lifetime remember, is pretty this indefinite is my now. Gift <laughs> to you. I will give you another vial when you need it, for your own use only. Do not sell it, or throw it away. After business, pleasure. Help yourself to a drink if you like. Jack seems to have done very well for himself, despite everything. Well, it doesn't seem like he's doing too well for himself now, but sure. Um, okay, I am over encumbered. Oh, I, I don't want to drop this stuff. Um... Is there a place I can put it for now and return later? I really need to... I, can I, do I have access to one of these? Okay, bottle cap and battery. Okay, I'm just going to transfer stuff into here. I need to remember I transferred the Zeta gun into here and come back and collect it. So, uh, yeah, store. And with that, can I run? Okay, I can run. Good stuff. I've got a lifetime... Oh, actually, no, I don't need to do that, right? I don't need to do that because I got this bad boy. You ready? Boom. And boom. And where is it going to be? Kim's. No, not there. A. Sure. I, I guess. Yeah. Well, I probably didn't need that. I was a bit... Uh, my guy had his tongue out, so I think he was actually addicted to something. Cool. Um, drinks. Where Where would it be? Misk. Da, 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 da. Coffee tin. I didn't even... Uh, in this entire time, I never even bothered to look at where this thing was okay let's go back into here okay into chems all right uh, drinks uh, why would it be in there radiated food why would it be in there food why would it, where is this uh where's this serum of yours is it a weapon is it why am i find why am i finding this so hard to find how am i finding this so hard to find is this me? Am I just being ridiculous right now? I feel like I am. Why is this... No, no, no. That's not what I wanted to do. Why is this... It's got to be an aid, right? How am... Uh, I'm so confused. Mysterious serum. How could it be in anything else aside from aid? It wouldn't be in apparel. It would not be in weapons. I only think it could be his misc, so maybe quest items. Okay, quest item. That, that's that is a that is a very weird way of uh, sorting that, but sure. <laughs> okay, mysterious serum. So, 
Uh, plus 50 damage resistance. Take 10 rads per second for 60 minutes. That is insane. And sh plus 5 strength for 60 minutes. So, and he said I've got a lifetime supply of this. So I can just come and get another one as needed. Wow, and that goes right up to 260. Wow, that is handy. Oh, you are, you are a good friend to me. Okay, let's see what your family had on them. Yes, yes. Hair trigger, hair trigger and compensated. Oh, good to see good you to too. See you again. Emojin Cabot's password. Do? Oh, there was a terminal I couldn't get into. Hey. Um, oh, okay, let's talk to you. Sure. So you've probably got some interesting things to say in your 400 years of that room. Are you really over 400 years old? Well, yeah, I would say that. We'll ask it anyway. <laughs> Are you really over 400 years old? Yes, I truly am. Although since I spent almost four centuries of that locked in a tiny room, yeah. I have spent most of my time exploring my own mind, as it were. I could Was imagine. Is there anything else? Um, I need more serum. I was just curious about the ancient artifact you always wear. Let's go with this one, and then I'm going to ask him for I more serum. I was curious serum. about the ancient artifact you always wear. Jack spent so many futile years trying to understand this. I could have told him everything he wanted to know. Through it, I commune with the ancient minds that founded our civilization. Whether they live within it, or it communicates with them through time or space, or whether it simply holds their memories, I don't know. What I do know that is, is insane. that it has widened my <laughs> horizons beyond the tiny scope granted to normal men. I spent my long That's probably why you don't hold on to things like relationships with family. <laughs> their arts and sciences, their philosophy and worldview. Are hmm. we done? Um, I need more serum. You reckon you could hook me up there? I need more serum. When you've used what I gave you, I will be glad to provide another vial. Ah, uh, okay. Did you need something else? Alright, so it's probably mechanic of you can only hold like one at a time, I would say. Never mind. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So it's probably mechanic of you can only uh, hold one at a time. Why is everything looking so crazy bright? Is that just me? Or is this... Or is it my light? No, it's not my light. Everything's just looking crazy bright. Is this something... Uh, this is looking... Okay, sure. Uh, imagine Cabot's password. Sure. Yes. Yes. Wanted loungewear. Okay, let's go up and check her terminal because I feel like there was a... I'm almost certain there was a... Oh, yes, I'm going to take that. I've got I've got the serum of the gods right now. I can take whatever I want. Um, okay. Let's go in, into here, was it? There was a terminal. And that, yeah. And boom, terminal. Imagine Cabot's password. Awesome. All right. Let's see what she... Oh, gosh. This is a huge log. All right. Another unwanted gift from my loving brother. Still, it might be interesting to play around with. Okay. This whole computer thing turned out to be more interesting than I thought. I've been learning a lot of various BBSES. What is that? A lot from BBSES. BBSES. Is that just like a? Is that just like I don't know. I don't even know. All right. Jack's been griping about some mistake he made in setting up the, his terminal. So I poked around until I found the file. It would be simple to fix it for him, but not nearly as much fun as watching him try to solve it on his own okay bit mean sure but uh was playing around with some new ideas and hit upon a good gag i wonder how long it will take the f uh, longer i wonder how long it will take jack to figure it out okay and next one went to see father again i just showed up at parsons and threatened to make a scene until jack finally agreed to let me go down i don't know why i keep going father puts on quiet and act for me but i know it's not really him not since he got back from his trip wearing that horrible crown i keep hoping that somehow he'll come back that i'll never see that i'll see even a glimmer of the real person again maybe jack will eventually succeed as annoying as he can be i can't deny that he's very smart okay so maybe i made the wrong decision <laughs> beginning to question um i went off the serum for a whole for a whole month i thought i could stick with it this time but when you actually feel yourself getting older by the day and you know you can fix it it's hard to give up youth and beauty voluntarily i bet most people couldn't do it if they had the choice yeah probably probably the case so this is from wow big break in making logs from here to here interesting and we're up to this one now oh geez a, a huge break between these logs 
All right. Uh, apparently, the Robco techs don't even know how their own systems work. I mean, it's just a simple bat file in the root directory of the database server, for crying out loud. Hardly the hack of the century or anything. Uh, okay, cool. Well... That is going to have to do it for today's episode, guys. If you guys are enjoying this playthrough as much as I am, please consider liking. Please consider subscribing. Every like means you getting a new like. Every subscribe means you getting a subscriber. It really, really helps out. Please also turn on the notification bell and leave any comments below. Any recommendations, any tips, or just stop by to say good day because I absolutely love the interaction. I promise I'll try and respond to everyone, but most of all, please have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.